disabled mops like here. Erica. I thought I'd chat with you guys on my drive to Columbus. I'm going to the dentist to uh, see about what they're going to do about my teeth. I have a rare genetic so I have. I've had to teeth issues my entire life. So now, there's starting to fall apart. I have missing so many teeth. It's just not even funny. So I'm hoping to get implants. Like or at least stitchers because they have to last for seven years. And yes, that's my country music that I absolutely love. In the background. Which is a very long, boring drive. It's like I'm coming from Morgantown, West Virginia, and I'm to Columbus, Ohio, and it's a three and a half hour drive. So I left this morning at 7.30, my appointment is at 10.30. I might be a little late, but uh, can't help it. I'm close enough. But it is so long and boring. So, more about the teeth. Since I have awkward dental digital dysplasia, which means that the teeth, the bones, Neurological, the digits, um, the entire ectoderma um, layer. As when you perform in your mom's belly, the ectoderma layer for me must be formed properly. So I have a lot of issues with that that are coming. I'm 40, and I was diagnosed at 7 years old with it, and I'm one of a thousand people worldwide. That's how rare this condition is. So, I was able, there's a foundation, it's called National Epidermal Dysplasia Foundation. So, three of them, I was able to find a higher university dental clinic, and they actually help people with epidermis displacements. And their dental clinic happens to be on Fridays. So every Friday. So since today I'm going well, to Columbus, my brother lives in, the, in Cincinnati, so I'm just gonna go visit him, spend the night, and get to see my nieces, my four nieces. They're, uh, the twins are two, and then their sisters are five and seven. And I don't, I don't come out here that often because of the gas. I just don't go out that much. So I'm gonna go visit them by appointment, which is uh, basically they're gonna do a treatment plan and then they're gonna give me two options today. So I'm either gonna get implants or a church, and it's up to me to decide between the two of them and what's gonna be. And they have to last for seven years because I'm on disability. I get state Medicaid and the uh, SSI. So with that, I have to be able to have have the teeth last me for seven years because I can only do this once every seven years, which is ridiculous to be honest. Ridiculous because people that have I wear a disease that affects their teeth, basically with dental, they're going to see the dentist more often than most people. Now I have let my teeth go, because I just didn't have the money to go and do it. 
And now I, I mean, I have the help, and I'm, I'm eating my teeth for six because it helps. It cut half a broken teeth. It cuts your entire health. Because that's, I mean, that's a direct path right into the blood stream. They can get supplements. So, that's going to be to do. So I thought I would just start vlogging because I, I mean, I, I love to vlog and my vlog is just a small small wife dot com and I think that I can do vlog too along with writing on my blog it might not be every day that I be long, but I always try once a week and update you on what I'm doing, what's happening. Okay, guys, I'm going to sign off for today. Another half hour before I get there. So long, so boring. So that's it for today. I'll post a link to my blog down below. And I'm hands free. Got my headphones on. That's how I'm vlogging, vlogging today. Have a good day.